I want to show you how to make the ultimate non-Newtonian fluid. These are going to be materials that are going to be easy to find in any kitchen. And the key ingredient, cornstarch. So our cornstarch goes into the bowl like this. Add small amounts of water and then mix it around with your hand. You're looking for a consistency that's close to that of honey. So here, how about a little bit more? Oh, that's good. All right, so I'm mixing it around. See, I'm trying to pull it off of the edges, and the consistency is amazing. You know that it's the perfect consistency when you can put your hand down in this liquid like this, and then try to pull up quickly and actually pick up the bowl at the same time. This is quicksand, right? Or it's very similar uh, to the properties of quicksand. So it's like cornstarch quicksand. It becomes a solid when you put it under pressure, and it becomes a liquid when you let it flow. So as you reach in here and you pull some up like this, you're actually pulling up this solid that immediately, look at this in your hands, turns right into a liquid. Try this, once you get the right consistency, I want you, now both hands are a mess, right? So pick some up like this, and then form it into a ball. So see if you can roll it into a ball. Oh, this is looking good, look at that. You're just gonna have to get the right kind of tempo as you're trying to roll it like this, because the moment you stop, it turns right into a liquid. That is a classic non-Newtonian fluid. But I'd be remiss if there wasn't one more thing to be able to do with that, and that is the slap test. Here we go. Three, two, one. Solid. And now watch what happens. You sink into it and you go to pick it up and it's almost like you're stuck inside of it as it comes up. As fun and awesome as this non-Newtonian fluid is, when you're done playing with it, because it's not gonna last forever, the best thing to do is to put it in the regular trash. Do not pour it down the drain, because if you do, well, this non-Newtonian fluid will sit in the very bottom of the drain. And then, the next experience is a plumber with a hacksaw and a pretty healthy bill. Don't put it down the drain, stick it in the trash, everything will be just fine. Okay.